Sebastian. Introducing first, running into the blue corner, who enters the ring wearing black trunks. He weighed in at 98.4 kgs or 217 pounds. He resides in Invercargo, and he is a father of seven. If you're keeping track, that's one more than the Brady Bunch. He has two wins, three losses. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Bluff Brawler, Tom Hands. And his opponent fighting out of the right corner, entering wearing black trunks with lettering. He weighed in at 112.5 kgs or 248 pounds. He was born in Samoa, lived in Glenfield, now resides in Toowoomba, Queensland, Australia. He has seven wins, five losses, with four big wins coming by way of KO. Introducing Herman, the Hermanator, and the Christian. Fighters to the center ring for Jan Allport's instructions. Hey guys, let's have a good clean fight. Protect yourselves at all times. Obey my commands at all times. Back to cars and wait for the bell. Good luck.
judges' scorecards for decision. Judge one scores the contest 48-47, red corner, and a for sub. Judge two scores it 46-49, blue corner, heads. And Judge three scores the contest 47-47, we have a draw! for that one. That guy's got arms the size of people's legs. What are your thoughts? The size of my legs. Oh my god. Yeah, you know, like, uh, I knew I had a big task stepping up to heavyweight and, and Herman uh, definitely proved why that was the case. Uh, hard man, man, hard man, big shots. If we, if we ask you to come back again for the rematch, you keep? Well, like I can never turn down the challenge, you know what I mean? It's, uh, it's in my blood. I can't do it. And I'm going to ask you, you guys, you got more kids than the Brady Bunch. Did you hear the I said he's the father of seven kids and everybody went, Ooh. What's it like having seven kids? It's busy, man. You know, like how, you know, I've got a time management as a kid. I've got to train to be Herman. Plus, have seven kids. It's a hard, it's, it's a hard task, man. Who would you like to thank for getting you in this kind of shape and, and, and having this kind of performance tonight? Yeah, Brendan and Herman and their team for, you know, being here. But without, without them, I'm going to fight. Steve, my manager for setting it up, Laurel, and all the boys at City Boxing looks, uh, all the boys are aspiring, you know, like, I made a, I made a hard move to come up to uh, Auckland from, from Southland, and sit, the boys at City just helped me, know me, you know, like, uh, my, my boxing's improved. Well, you are a crowd favorite, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up, I'm going to rename you the Buck Buck Brawler, Tom Hennis. Holy moly, look at them all over here. You got a million of them over here. Maybe not seven, but a lot. Wow, great fight. What are your thoughts? Uh, yeah, no, first of all, thank you very much for, uh, for going to be and uh, blessing me with all the opportunities. Uh, um, well, it is what it is, but, but to be honest, I got a lot of rest up on the third. I mean, well, <laughs> what is it? Well, I don't understand, you know, but uh, look, it is what it is. Uh, special shout out to my trainer, Brendan Smith. Uh, you know, put a lot of hard yards in. And, uh, uh, shout out to our uh, wife from boxing, uh, Marlo. My man, thanks to everything, brother. Look to all my family and my friends, you know. Thanks all, guys. Yeah. Now, who would you like to, uh, who else would you like to thank just uh, for getting you this tie tonight and getting you where you're at? Yeah, uh, nothing like Lisa Lewis. Uh, thanks, Lisa, for the opportunity. I mean, it was one of my dreams to come back over and find in New Zealand. And uh, look, I thank you for coming. Uh, rematch with Tom Hanks, look, I would love to. I just don't understand why the ref stopped in the third round for what? So that was my next question. You're keen on, on a rematch? Yeah, bloody hell, I just do it. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the Hermanator! Herman and a Purcell!